All right, looking forward to hearing that, Jonah. And, uh, you know, this sale's got a lot of fans wondering, who is Miriam Adelson? Tiffany Liu has more on the family's business background and why Cubans specifically wanted to sell to them. Dallas, on the sidelines of the roaring American Airlines Center, he's a familiar face, one of the most well-known, Mark Cuban, the owner of the Dallas Mavericks, for the last 23 years. Mark Cuban sells the Dallas Mavericks. News broke <laughs> Tuesday. What? Cuban is selling a majority stake of the Mavs franchise, something most fans never pictured. <laughs> including Nick Angstead, the voice of the Locked On Mavericks podcast. And welcome, you are locked on to the Dallas Mavericks. One of the biggest questions is who will be the new owner? Her name is Miriam Adelson, and her family, the Adelsons and Dumonts, are working on the deal. A quick search will tell you this. She was <laughs> listed as the fifth most wealthy woman in the world, which is an insane thing to think about. At that point, you're talking about like, Monopoly money. Adelson is wealthy beyond most imaginations with a net worth over $32 billion. The Las Vegas Sands is the family's casino and resort company, but even with their empire 1,200 miles west in Nevada, Adelson has plans in Texas. I know she also has deep ties with the Republican Party here in Texas with uh, Greg Abbott. She and her late husband, multi-billionaire Sheldon Adelson, are some of the Republican Party's largest financial supporters. She received the Presidential Medal of Freedom from former President Donald Trump in 2018. It's absolutely a political move. Like, it's fully out there. The future is uncertain, but Angstead has a guess. Eventually, I feel like down the line, this is going towards gambling becoming legal in Texas, the Mavericks in Las Vegas Sands coming together and creating a new Mavericks arena with a resort, with a casino, with all that together somewhere in Dallas. That's kind of been Cuban's goal for the last couple of years. Know this, Mavericks fans. Mark Cuban, while $3.5 billion wealthier, plans to continue leading the Dallas Mavs, just no longer as majority owner. Let's go, man! In Dallas, I'm Tiffany Liu.